Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. This video demonstrates how to program the travel on DC gate operators manufactured before 2022. Programming the limits allows you to control where the gate will stop in the open and closed positions. And if you need to fine tune any one of the limits later, there is no need to go through the entire setup procedure. Each limit can be adjusted individually without affecting the other. This video is intended for demonstration purposes only. Please consult the manual for complete instructions and safety information. Using the LA500, we'll demonstrate how to program the limits and adjust the force on a LiftMaster gate operator. You'll need access to the control board. We'll begin with the gate in the closed position. The gate switch is located on the control board. Set the gate switch to 1. Press and release the Set Open and Set Close buttons at the same time to enter programming mode for limits. If limits have not been set, the LEDs next to the Set Open and Set Close buttons will be flashing. If either or both LEDs are solid, press and hold the Set Open and Set Close buttons at the same time until both LEDs begin to flash. To set the open limit, press and hold the appropriate Move Gate button until the gate is in the desired open position, then release. Use the other Move Gate button to adjust the position if needed. Press and release the Set Open button to set the open limit. The Set Open LED is now solid. Now press and hold the Move Gate buttons until the gate is in the desired closed position, then release. Press and release the Set Close button to set the close limit. The Set Open and Set Close LEDs are now off. To complete programming and automatically set the force, run the gate operator through a complete open and close cycle. For this demonstration, the limits on the secondary operator had already been set. If you need to set limits on a secondary operator, be sure the gate switch is set to 2. The reversal force control allows you to manually increase or decrease the force after it has been set automatically. If the gate stops or reverses before reaching the fully open or closed position, make small increases in the force by turning the reversal force control slightly clockwise. To make adjustments to either of the limits, press and release the Set Open and Set Close buttons at the same time. Because limits have already been set, the LEDs will be solid. To adjust the close limit, use the Move Gate buttons to position the gate and then press the Set Close button. The Set Open and Set Close LEDs are now off. To complete adjustment and automatically set the force, run the gate operator through a complete open and close cycle. Be sure to test the safety reversal system after any adjustments. Refer to the manual to learn how to perform the obstruction test. Environmental factors such as snow on the ground or strong wind may cause the gate to reverse if the force setting is not sufficient. Set the force high enough to avoid these nuisance interruptions, but low enough to prevent injury to a person. Thank you for choosing LiftMaster. Remember to visit us on the web at liftmaster.com or the dealer extranet.